unboxing video and today we have this I haven't even pre-opened it like I do I want to do that on camera so let's see if I need if I don't need my knife oh this thing this thing is tough this thing It is a HDMI splitter cable. That way I don't have to keep unplugging my 360 and plugging my Xbox One in to my Elgato. And then that plugs into my TV. So I can get it on my TV. So we're going to just open it. We're going to take it out and see. has a one two three and a button so there's that and then the three HDMI inputs sorry it's blurry I'm blur nope I tried to do the kid behind the camera trick where he puts his hand in front of it and it focuses on the hand and then it goes to this hey it worked thanks Thanks, Mike. And then the little cap, and that's HDMI. So, uh, I will be having my Xbox One and input one, my 360 and input two. I don't have anything for input three yet. And then this will be going to my Elgato and then my Elgato to my TV because oh, let me knock off my other headphones there's a alright here's the Elgato it's sorry plugged this plugs into the computer then it's in so this part will go in and then out is from the this to the TV, so that's what will be happening very shortly. I'm not going to do it on camera, of course. I'm just going to do it, so it'll make life easier. I have to pick up my headphones. I dropped my 360 Turtle Beach headphones. Come on, there we go. It's pulling on something. I don't know what it is. There we go. Now it's not pulling on. It was wrapped around my HDMI cable to my TV. So. Alright. This is called a Fosman. Fosman? I don't know. Three t and three times one HDMI pigtail switch with 50 cm HDMI cable. Supports 3D. So. I got this at Walmart, my local Walmart, online though. It was $7.99 and they did not charge me tax or shipping, so it was flat out $7.99. It specifications is supports 12-bit deep color, supports 3D devices, maximum single link video range, 1920 times 1200, I mean, sorry. 1920 times 1200 1080p output video HDMI 1.3b plus HDCP 1.0 slash 1.1 pretty much every video HD format I don't know and it has 24k gold plated connector I know Andrew said that's good there's that if you want to read it if it unblurs unblur Focus on my hand now. There's that. I'm sorry it's blurry, but you can kind of make it out. 
wish it would just unblur. Like seriously. I don't know, the hand trick didn't work, this didn't work. I if you really want to know I could write it down in the description. The whole specifications, so um yeah. Has a video amplifier bandwidth two point five G PBS two hundred and fifty MHZ, I think it's megahertz per color. Maximum bandwidth per display is seven point five GBPS. No power adapter needed if connected to input devices that provide necessary power over HDMI cables. Not recommended for mobile devices unless your mobile device is plugged into a power source. So Okay. Um like I said, here it is. It has a button for select and then does that. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Apparently I was told I need to start doing that. So, Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Peace. You thought we was done? We're not done yet. We gotta see this thing light up in the video. And it's all tangled so. Alright. Uh, where's uh, HDMI? Let's try this. This one here. Nope, not that one. Where? There we go. So, let's put this. This is my 360, I think. Uh, where's my. That's an empty one. I guess I should have figured out what to do before I did this, but whatever. So, what is, so th this is 360, this is Xbox One, and then this will be to my Elgato. Now, turn that on. Oh, the light came on. Then you switch between the thing. Look at that pretty blue light. Ooh, it's like half face lights. <laughs> but yeah, there you go. That's my. Ooh, this could be a good thumbnail. <laughs> hmm. Alright. We wasn't done when you first thought, so oh, we're done now. Thanks for watching. Peace.